Okay, um, I was not planning on recording this. I was gonna get this horse and then just, just record after I got him. But dude, what is going on here? It's one of those gas things. I'm in the middle of nowhere, dude. I am in the absolute middle of nowhere, but somebody's been here. Um, but I just want this horse. So I gotta put him in the helicopter. Hopefully he'll stay, hopefully he'll go in. Um, these animals usually usually go in helicopter pretty well. Hop on in there, buddy. Yeah, get stuck. Get stuck real good in a helicopter. That should do. Oh my goodness, dude. I can't believe it. We got him! We got him! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's get a close up. Horse! Horse is in, baby. Horse aboard. All right, well, let's take him back to the base. Let's do this. Yes! What? You never seen a horse riding a helicopter before? Come on, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, so we got a horse and a helicopter. You know, it's it's no big deal. It's just a, it's just a horse and a helicopter, for goodness sakes. Um... Well, you're probably wondering, you're probably asking yourself, okay, what's what's his angle? What's he doing with a horse in a helicopter? And it's a fine question. It's a great question. Oops. Ha. It's a great question. What am I doing with a horse in a helicopter? Great question. Here's the only problem. Um, not answering that today but you will find out in due time. That time is not now. That time is not very soon, but you'll find out. You'll find out why I have a horse. Um, you know, when you're in battle, there are a lot of angles. And sometimes in a modern warfare kind of situation like we're in, you need every angle, so yeah, you just hang out there. I'll come back for you at another time. You cute, it's cute, cute horse. So I hope you're all doing great. Um, I'm doing pretty well, it's about 3 a.m. <laughs> I just live streamed again. Guys, I just live streamed and I'm doing the recording thing after the live stream again. Um, going Christmas shopping. So I had to do the recording tonight. I'm not complaining. Um, I'm just doing it. So check this out. This is something we did in the live stream. I just want to catch you guys up for those of you who weren't there. Um, this is the garage slash hangar. You know, dude, look at this. Huge shout out to Cube for helping me fix this. Like, dude, okay. Uh, let me tell you something. Yeah. Let me just make sure I don't break anything. Okay. So Cube helped me set this up. What in the world is this, you know? Okay, those of you who know Redstone, you know exactly what's going on. Me, I don't know Redstone, I got I got no clue. I just wanted to throw, you know, the lever here, throw some Redstone up there, connect to Redstone on the other side. No, 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 it's gotta be all crazy. Uh, whoops, blast, shoulda used, shoulda used the silk touch pick. Silk touch puck? Silk touch pick. <laughs> um, yeah, that's another thing we did in the stream. I was gonna make another pickaxe, but I was like, why don't I just add the silk touch to this? So I did. Added the silk touch to this. Um, yeah, yeah. And you might notice I grabbed some of these. This was from my flight. I just saw <laughs> I saw another, uh, what you call it? Tinker's Island, whatever you wanna call it, and grabbed a few more materials. Schism. Flew his way into the hangar on my paraglider, so that's why that's there. Maybe we can make room for that. It's just so huge. I don't know. I don't know if we'll have room for that. But yeah, dude, that was that was one of the fun things we did during the stream. Um, let's see. What else? What else did we do? Oh, I'll tell you another thing we did, but really quick check this out i think we were just talking about this last episode these trees and i talked to skids about this in the lot in the live stream we did a little dual stream um i said okay do the trees have to be planted on that special 
slime dirt or whatever for them to grow. And he said, yeah, pretty sure. I said, well, that's strange because I didn't used to have to. You don't have to. So that was a huge relief. Huge relief for me that you can just plant these wherever you want. Give me, I already had to. Give me another sapling, please. I don't know. But this is gonna be, this is gonna be great, man. Um, okay, yeah, let's break this. Don't need that. Your toast. Oh wow, did that re release steam? That released steam. Some kind of steam thing. Huh, what do you know? What do you know? Okay, so that will be planted there. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we got some more planted. Beautiful, beautiful. There are some saplings. Oh, let's plant a couple more. Because guys, like, I really think, I really think these will be great. Plus I have more plans for, for slime. Um, yeah, I got a lot of plans and they will be revealed as time goes on. Um, but check this out. You know, I think I've, I think I've shown this before. Look at this. <laughs> you get a bunch of slime balls from these things. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So I was gonna tell you another thing we did during the live stream. Holy crap! Where, you... uh oh, surplus of slime trees. Um, crap. Maybe I should have made a room for this. Yeah. Well, uh, another thing we did on the live stream. Schism and I. I know we're on different teams, but we kind of teamed up to start working on a little project. We both want this gas detector and crap i should organize my inventory um we both want this gas detector the thing is sweet you know you can it, i think it'll sh show you gases within within a 10 block radius it's not great but it's the best we got but the thing is you need this gas sensitive chip and it requires a block of refined diabolene to make refined diabolene you have to Smelt it. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Why can't I? Eh. Oh, it'll show, it'll show. Okay, to make it. You smelt it. You smelt it, uh, Yeah, you smelt it in a, ga in a gas furnace, <laughs> bottom line. But dude, smelting it in a gas furnace is not as easy as it sounds. Um, you have to get a flammable gas. Yes, this wasn't working all stream. You have to get a flammable gas, and then you have to um, you have to make it go through the pipes, through a pump, I think. Yeah, and then to the gas furnace. Um, and there's two types of diabolene, and you have to get the right stuff. I think this is the wrong stuff. There's another one. This is 730. I think it's the 717 that works. Uh, yeah, the 717. Anyway, it took us a very long time, but we finally got it. We just got enough for both of us to make a block. So, um, give me that back. Yeah, dude, I didn't even know I already had. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, I need to start making this stuff. Um, okay. I think we'll be okay. I know the inventory is, it's messed up. I'm sorry, but we'll, we'll deal. We'll deal. Let's throw, let's throw some stuff in the knapsack. That'll make it a little more bearable for you guys to see. We'll get this on the hot bar. I'm going to need that. And we'll need this. Throw a little slime in it. A little slime in it. Beautiful. Don't need it. Gotcha. Okay. Throw this. Throw this. There. Okay. We cleared things up a little bit. All right. So let's make this gas detector. So you need black of, of refined diabolene, redstone, and gold. Oh, wow. So we got the redstone. And oh my goodness, dude. I. Whoops, I didn't realize, hey, didn't realize I gave so much gold to generic. 
I gave him just about all my gold. Oh, no, 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 no. I got more. Oh, I got more. See, the thing is, I just watched Generic's video. Um, Generic B, he did some, he did some collaborating with Schism and with B double O. Everyone was giving him some ideas or some presents and buying stuff from him. But in the end, he said right now, why did that stay in the crafting bench? That usually doesn't do it with the normal one. I don't know. Um, but anyway, he said he's siding with Team Black for now. And dude, guys, um, I gotta tell you, I just watched my brother's video too, and I was laughing out loud because he said, he said Team, uh, he said Team Red, they got nothing. They they don't got any weapons they got they, they're just not set up at all and dude we're team red but i was laughing so hard <laughs> because uh i keep doing the same thing in my live streams like you guys keep reminding me i keep referring to us as team black and them as team red i don't know why i don't know why john was doing it either but we're we're both doing it and I think it's funny and oh yes I need this okay um, but bottom line we are team we are team red they're team black I don't know why dude I just don't know why <laughs> that we we get it mixed up but it's over it's over it's, we will not get it mixed up anymore okay so this will go there we got the sampler I think we got everything we need to make this thing dude this there this there hello gas detector guys i think we have the first gas detector on the server maybe diabling ore <laughs> not sure what he wants um you know speaking of ty i think ty is the only one on the server um, we got this gas detector. I wonder. He was talking about. I think he's. I think he said he had a little gas. Let's see if this will work on him. I'm totally kidding. I can't keep that bit up. Oh wow. Okay. Target practice time. They're dead. Okay. Does Ty want a gas detector too? Man, this might be uh man, if I get another one going, this could be a hot a hot selling item. Okay, what does he want? This is my first time seeing it. Okay, I don't think Dude, I don't think the dabbling does anything else. Uh, dabbling. Yeah, uses. Block. Uses. Yeah, that's it, dude. Uses. Gas detector. Gas detector. Yeah, that's all it does. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Nah. I was going to send him on a wild goose hunt. Um, is that what it's called? Wild goose hunt? Wild goose chase? Um, to try to smelt it in the gas furnace. Dude, that took Skiz and me hours to figure that out. Um, but really, I don't need another gas detector. <sighs> I take it back. <laughs> I take it back. It would be cool to have another one. <laughs> that's too evil um well it's up to him i'll pay him i'll pay him if he wants to do it it's not easy it's not easy uh but guys ty's a great guy check him out if you haven't already 
Okay, what's next? What's next? I, I did want to, before we test out the gas uh, detector, I wanted to just show you guys a couple things. You've probably already seen this, but dude, we gotta address this. Schism put a crater on our side. I guess he was in one of Ty's buildings and shot this thing. Dude, it just demolished the place. Get me out of here. Demolished the place. So, he set this up. It actually is kind of nice looking. Did a little unintentional redecorating. Enjoy your new beachfront walkway and view. Don't fire the big green gun ever for any reason at all. Skiz. So this is kind of cool. Um, different color texture on the fences. Not sure if he ran out or if he was going for a textured look. But that's cool. Uh, he did leave the big hole. But I don't know. It's kind of growing on me. I don't know. Uh, another thing we did during the stream, I made this bridge because, dude, I go from I go from our place to Aladdin so much. So I was like, hey, let's make a bridge. Let's make the bridge the same texture that John was doing with with the roads. You know, get the limestone, get these, 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 these. So I make this bridge, and I don't know. I wasn't happy with it, but hey, what are you gonna do? It's a bridge. It works. I'm happy with it. Okay. Um, yeah, it's time. Let's let's uh, let's test out this gas detector. I really don't know. Uh, I don't know how well it's gonna work. Like, I think it beeps if there's a gas in a ten block radius. So I right click. It says sampleable block. I don't know what a sampleable block is. So let's just let's just look around. Okay. Now when we were in the Mesa biome, dude, there were there was gas all over the place. I don't know, man. I guess my next question is do you have to have the gas in it huh does it only search for specific gases I guess I should have looked into that a little more like I I was reading the instructions online but it oh king slime but it didn't really say yeah it didn't really say so I'm just right clicking like crazy Oh, baby. Oh. You can never have too much iron. Um, so I'm right clicking like crazy. I'm not really getting any readings. But like I said, like um, the way this works is you can. Okay. With a detector, you can put these inclusion samplers at the end of it. You can put those in this little, you see that little bottle there? But my question is, I don't, do you have to? Well, blast. I guess the only way to answer the question is to find some gas. Yeah, that's how we'll do it. I'll just look for some gas. I'll actually find gas that I can see and then we will see if um, if it makes any noises, and if not, then that just proves, hello, that just proves that it has to have something in it. Okay, let's see if I can find some gas, and then I will come back when we find some, and we'll see, we'll see how this thing works. I found gas. I don't know what kind of gas, but it's gas. So let's hit this. It's not making a noise. Okay. Dude, I wonder what kind of gas that is. Is that red gas? Oh, baby. Okay. So this red gas, it's actually... This stuff, I think, is pretty rare and pretty valuable. Um. Okay. What's happening? What's happening? Is it just settling down? Okay. Yeah, it's just settling down. Um, wait, 
Wait. Do you guys hear that? It's making a sound. So it's making a sound. No way. No way. Okay, I gotta admit, that's pretty cool. So the further away you are, the lower pitch the sound is. So yeah, it says it goes in a 10 block cone away from you. So you gotta be facing it. So that's why it wasn't making the noise before. It wasn't making the noise because I wasn't pointing at it. So this is outside the cone. But the closer you get, the higher pitch the sound. Okay, that's awesome. And it's great to know you don't have to specify, but you can specify the type of gas if you want to. So dude, that's, that's cool. So you can just right click all over the place. Okay, that's pretty cool. I'll say this, I'll say this. Um, it would probably be more effective if it detected it from a further distance. But, hey, either way, that's pretty cool. Um, I don't know how rare this stuff is, so I'm actually gonna make a waypoint I'm pretty sure that's the red gas. And I'm I'm pretty sure that's what it's called too. I'm just gonna make a waypoint just in case. But guys, that is that is really cool. Excuse the burp. Um yeah. Uh let's not throw it away. Uh yeah, okay. Okay, so this is what we do. I leave now. I leave this place. I just went to a random random cave. So we're gonna head back. Uh oh, <laughs> I'm allergic to the gas. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna head back and um, check out a few more things around town. So I will see you there. So the question is, can I stick the landing? Okay, so I made these waypoints. Thanks again to Cube. It was Cube's idea to do these waypoints before oh no when we were team gold oh didn't do it i missed it oh that wasn't too bad only dropped one health point on the plane just took a little damage that wasn't too bad okay ah i wanted it to be a perfect one hit a perfect landing on the stream but you can't win them all so last thing i wanted to do was just take a look at something my brother did um, his video yesterday, if you haven't seen it already, definitely check it out. He made a little something over here. Now, okay, I'll admit, I had to skip through a little bit because, you know, like I said, it's it's 3 a.m. Right now, it's 3.50 a.m. Oh my goodness, I am a crazy person. But, um, I couldn't watch the whole video, but from what, I've, what I saw... He made this weapon cache. This awesome... Oh, dude, we are infested with King Slimes. Where's this one? A lot of times they'll just be on, up on the trees. Eh. Eh. Oh, there he is. See, he's up on a tree. Gotcha. Okay, so I'm gonna get his remains, and then, another one? Okay, we'll get his remains, and then, we will check out the weapons cache. Where are the remains? Etho, great job. Etho, great job with your place. It's amazing, what, what does he got over here? What is that? Oh! That's a remote control helicopter. He's got a slime, slime cleaver. I got one of those. Dude, 14 attack damage. Oh, there are the remains. Okay. Um, blast, ethyl, I'll fix. 
Dude, I see another king slime over there. I can't be bothered with all these king slimes. Okay, give me that. Another cleaver. No, that's just a regular sword. Don't need it. We got two of those. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I don't need another sword. I got the cleaver. That's fine. Um, I already got a good sword. Okay. <sighs> Playtime's over. Let's check out this weapon cache. So back to the weapons cache. Okay. So we got Gunman. Evening Gunman. We've got, looks like a G36. Looks like an MP5. Looks like a python. Uh, shotgun. Uh, AK-47. Uh, something else. L96. Uh, is that an L96 or is that a Barrett with the red skin? I don't know. It looks, sure looks a lot like mine. Uh, riot shield. Okay. Okay. So he trades. Hello. Hello, pungents. Hello, gunman. Uh, he trades. But no trades as of yet. Here's a question. Um, what's a guy gotta do? Hello! What's a guy gotta do to get this stuff, you know? Yeah. Um, the secret's out. I couldn't find any gas. But I found it! <laughs> um, okay, so what's a guy gotta do to get this stuff? Do I just grab? Is it just... Come in and grab? I don't know. Can the team get it? Do they have to pay a price? Do we have to pay a price? I don't know. Oh, that's cool. These are all crates. So that's what we will find out. But either way, great job, brother. Oh, hello. Hello. Okay. Uh, great job, brother. And I can't wait to see what happens out of it. Because if this is something to where the black team... Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? How did this happen? I, I know Etho made this guy. He's got like the spider body and stuff. Taikono. But I have no idea how he ended up in John's helicopter. Um, but yeah, if this is something where Black Team is going to have to pay to, you know, to, to use gunman's services, that could be pretty good. I don't know. Um, what I do know is I need to get going. It's just about 4 a.m., so it's time to go to sleep. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I have the next project is actually, I'm just going to tell you, I keep holding all these secrets. The next project is going to be, um, a lot of people have mentioned this as well as an idea. It's going to be a, a way to um, go from one base to another easily so I don't, to be honest I'm just gonna do it as an option we're probably just gonna stick to the normal above ground traveling but I'm gonna make this as an option it could be very valuable during the battle um, but I'm gonna be working on that a little bit more but guys we're gonna call it for today as always, thank you so much for watching. If I get this video up tomorrow, which is Thursday, yeah, this is the last possible day to get my t-shirt before the design is gone forever. So if you wanted it, uh, today's the day. But yeah, guys, dude, you, you all are so awesome. Thank you for all, all of the um, likes that you gave on the last video. It really was. It's, it's really more than I than I expect. You guys always blow me away. So thank you so much. Um, yeah. Next video, hopefully we'll, we will start working on this transportation system. And I hope you like my idea for it. It's a little different. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, it's going to do it. Thank you for watching. And I will talk to you later.